What's up guys, this is Fab one the Fire Queen Sun here, and welcome to part 83 of the Grand Truth Part 3. And it's time to finally start Amateur League. Woo! And now that we got all the rally events out of the way, and the car they're going to be using for our first single race series in Amateur League is going to be the Salka SS2. Hooray. And I'm going to open this car a little bit. Not a lot, but a little bit. Starting with the racing tires, because... This is actually kind of a spoiler, but not really. But every single series, including professional league, will have tire wear. So keep that in mind. And let's see. And... Let's go with this. Yeah. Stage 2 aspiration. Uh, let's do stage 3. Ho 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 ho. No. Although, actually, well, that's 70,000 credits, so no. 70,000 credits is way too much for that. Uh, we'll get this as well. For insurance or something, I don't freaking know. Uh, wait. No. Not entirely sure how much horsepower we need to add. Like, power and polish will automatically be connected to this car since you can't take it off. It's automatically on the car. It's hard to figure out if I want this or not. And uh, nah, we're gonna leave it. Okay, you know we're gonna. No. Nah. That's going to be all the upgrades I'm going to put on this car. Anyways, here we go. Amateur League. And, like always, I'm going to be saving these championships for last. And, yeah, our first single series of the Amateur League is going to be the FF Challenge. Hooray. And since I already explained the title, aka the dialogue for the, uh, well, when you're sitting on the screen, you know, for those who want to try more sports, but far more try, yeah, that. I'm not going to say it again, though, because I said it in the video link, so I'm going to have a So, like always, three single races and FF cars only, obviously. And start with our first race at Gate Forest. Hooray. Also, hi, El Camino, that are sitting in front of my TV. How are you doing? Um, yeah, I should probably imagine where I got those two things from. I mean... I mean, you can, you can clearly see in front of my TV, there's two El Caminos sitting there. The red and the dark blue one, yeah. Uh, anyways, uh, this may or may not be an interesting series, considering that I got like a one second pull, but... I don't know. That FTO was actually ahead at certain points. So, I actually have no idea how this will go. Like I said, starting like on a one second pull, that's probably not going to mean much. So this will be an interesting series, probably. Yeah, I guess we'll find out in five laps. Yeah, the thing about Amsterdam League is, these races are a little bit longer. So instead of two laps, we're doing five laps. Hooray! Which means these videos are going to be going on longer. And it'll also involve more segments. So we'll break from that. Uh, I saw it though. Doing really well. I mean, I'm more concerned about the FTO more than anything. I'm not entirely sure how good this guy is. Somehow I got a clean over to right there. And here's my top. 
time unit right here. It's that guy minion anytime. That's so weird that within my qualifying lap, I gained like a second on him on that last turn. How? I don't even know. Yet this time when he does the race, he does it perfectly on the race. Ugh. Also, that first turn is difficult because. Uh, this car does not like this first turn. I just cannot take it correctly. It just always wants to go wide every time. Okay, well, I'm definitely gonna stay in third year for that turn. Because, uh, yeah, I actually screwed up that first turn on my qualifying lap because the car just would not turn. Because, uh, that's what FF cars do, they don't turn! <laughs> <sighs> there may or may not have been a voice crack in that lap. And what's it gonna win the second year on that one turn when I didn't need to? So, now that I'm in the lead, am I going to pull away, or is he going to keep up? I have no idea. I'm just so glad that I'm finally starting to use the because I've actually been wanting to do this for a while. Because we've been doing the rally events for, I don't even know, like 30, no. We've been doing the rally Rate, or we've been doing the rally events for about 27 minutes. And I think we started the rally events back in the mid 60s as far as the videos we the front play. And we finally ended the rally events on part 82. So, alright. Well, looks like, as far as the race goes, they are actually going to keep up with me, so, race lap. Okay, do not put a second gear me. Second gear is not needed for this time. I'm not taking a little slow, but whatever. I seriously was not sure if I was going to be underpowered or overpowered for the series. Because once I started my qualifying lap, like I could tell that I was already pulled away. I'm like, wait a minute, am I overpowered? And then once I saw the FTL get the pull, I'm like, okay, no, I'm not overpowered, I'm absolutely even. So that's good. And I did not want to <laughs> have to take up rings off because I was so overpowered. Okay, man. Okay, uh, Very 
that last trans is gonna be annoying on the power the AI's been acting with me literally on the last trans. Because they get really fast for no reason on the pot rays. And they haven't done that nearly, so I want to really do it in instantly. Who 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 who? Trippin' hope not. Trippin' hope not for the My uh, seven type R, because I forgot I had that. But I'm not sure if that thing had more horsepower than the Selga or not. So I just went with the Selga because I never used it yet. So yeah. Yeah, stuff and yeah, stuff and yeah, stuff and yeah, stuff, yeah, stuff, yeah, stuff. Sakurai Spo. Um, wow. I think I'm actually going to take some power off this car now. Maybe I did make this car a little bit overpowered. Uh, we will, well, I'm not taking the stage too well, that's for sure. And that's gonna... Yeah, that's gonna endure him way too much. Yeah, that might endure him too much. So I'm gonna take this off. And not to mention that I actually don't know if I'll have enough time to do this race. I freaking hope so. Anyways, I'll figure it out. So yeah, three second pull on them. I uh, how? How did I get how did I get a three second pull? I have a feeling that I might be able to power them. I'm not even sure. Perhaps I should have got the stage one turbo. Why would you say turbo? Perhaps I should have got the stage one aspirant, not the stage two. Uh, yeah, whatever. So this will be an easy race. Looks like. I don't think I have enough time to do this race because I'm already at almost, I'm already almost at 23 minutes. I wasn't paying attention. I'm already almost at 23 minutes. And 23 minutes will not be in. And seven more minutes will not be enough time to do this race. So I'm gonna have to actually cut until uh, we're not we're not. I'm actually not gonna cut anything out. I'm actually going to have to end the video while I'm still doing the screen, because I'm actually not happy now. So I may actually have to do, so I may ask, so I may actually have to do one race per segment now. Which is something I don't like doing, because I'd rather have fit a lot of them in all in one video, that's not going to happen.
So now I know what to do for uh, the next race. Or, well, not the next race, but the next series. For this last lap. So, if you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a like, and I'll scroll down in the comment section below. How to find a video? 
And uh, yeah, we will finish up the second race and the FX challenge, and we will also do the final race in the next video as well. Which will also wrap up the FF challenge in general. So, uh, yeah, it's been a fan of the Martin Fiend Central, and I'll see you guys later.